It's Rakita and I'm back with another video. So I in this video, I want to talk to you guys about this comment that I got. So somebody put that they got approved for the dealership card and not the Visa card. And they have a $3,000 limit. And they said, should they keep it because they do not have a Lexus? So they're saying, thank you for this video. It has been very helpful. So you're definitely welcome. I'm guessing your name is Tony. You're definitely welcome. Now, if I were you, depending on how many credit cards I have, I would possibly keep it because that credit card can help you with your utilization. So let me show you like the different credit cards that you all can um, use for your utilization. And not only that, some easier credit cards you guys can apply for that I didn't even add to yet that utilization list. Because if you guys use too much money on your credit cards, your credit score is going to drop. But if you have a lot of those like $3,000, $5,000, $10,000 cards, then you guys can keep those on your credit reports. Let them keep reporting to the credit bureaus. But when you use your credit cards, your credit score is not going to drop because it's so much more credit you're not utilizing. So let me know if you guys understand what I mean by that. So go and look on my website, All Things Rikita. You will look under credit cards. I'm going to show you how you can get more of those $3,000 cards so that you can um do something i call um cushioning your credit reports you can cushion your credit reports especially if you that person that like to spend money on credit cards maybe use it for business um too and you know maybe you're just living on your credit cards right now it is what it is right i'm gonna show you what you could do to cushion your reports so you want to go all the way down to um you all want to go down to utilization credit cards and let me show you so if you need to cushion your credit reports, you need to get credit cards to help with your utilization, then you definitely want to get these credit cards. That way, if you max out some of your credit cards, your credit score is not going to drop that much and you're going to be able to get approved for other credit cards because you have these credit cards in your credit reports. Now, these credit cards can be like the Apple credit card, FNBO, Navy Federal, Tumo, Smile Generation, the Alfion, and the Care Credit. Now, the Apple, the FNBO, Navy Federal, the Tumo, they, those are credit cards where they're Visa or MasterCard and you can use them anywhere, right? So you are going to be able to use those, right? You're going to use those, but more of a cushioning credit card where you're not really going to use it, but it's straight helping you keep your utilization down and helping you boost your credit score more. Um, that's going to be like the Smile Generation because with that Smile Generation credit card, I got approved uh, for this one. And I see a lot of people get approved for this one. And this one is only for if you really want to get your teeth done. And a lot of people don't want to get their teeth done. But this can be a great credit card if you want them just to report to all three credit bureaus. And it can help with your utilization. So that's one that you can apply for. Now, you can't pre-qualify for that one. So that's like the bad part about that. But the next one, the Alfion, you can actually pre-qualify for this one. I don't have it on here, but I'm going to make sure I add the note to this one. So you guys can pre-qualify for this one without a hard inquiry. They're going to be able to let you know yes or no if you can get it. But this one right here can give you a $10,000, $15,000 limit because this, again, is like cosmetic surgery. Some people get their breasts done, get their their butt done, get their, um, I don't know, lipo done. They get all the stuff done with this one, and they need a large um, limit to be able to do that. But if you all are not looking to get those different things done, you can still get this credit card right here. Let them report to the credit bureau, and they'll do something like cushion. It'll, it'll cushion your credit report. So that if you were to max out some of your other credit cards or use too much of your other credit cards, your credit score won't go down as much because now you have a $10,000 credit card with Alfion and a $7,000 credit card with Smile Generation. You got $17,000 worth of credit you're not utilizing. And you, uh, you've you probably seen my other videos where people were using you know, $200 in their credit and their credit scores dropped down 50 points. And that's because they just don't have enough credit cards. But if they had these credit cards, their credit score would be going up and not down. So those are two you want to look into. And care credit can actually pre-qualify you without a credit check too. So it's not secured and unsecured. That's another mistake I have. I have to go ahead and fix this. This is not perfect, you all. I'm, this is something I'm just putting it together for you all so that you'll have one place where you can go and look at all the credit cards. So um this one right here the care credit again is for cosmetic surgery cosmetic treatments dental work eye exam lasik um, vision surgery or if you're trying to go to the vet you're trying to do some weight loss or your hearing then this is what care credit is for it's used at two hundred and fifty thousand doctor's office doctor's offices or 
um, any of the places that we just named, basically. But this is only for that. But they can pre-qualify you without a hard inquiry. And somebody left a comment yesterday. Um, let me see if I can uh, find it for you all. Yeah, right here. Thank you. I applied for $5,000 and um, got approved. I forgot all about the care credit I've been using my other credit card for medical expenses all this time. So somebody just applied for that care that care credit and got approved for $5,000, T. Miller. So congratulations to you. That is really good. And that can be a cushion and credit card. Make, you know, they need it for medical expenses, but you probably got a whole game plan. You don't need it for medical expenses. But still having that $5,000 credit card on your credit reports can really help boost your um, credit score up. So that's something to think about. And that don't forget that original person had three thousand extra. What if they added that five thousand? That'd be perfect. Now there's a few more credit cards that I want you all to look at, and I think I'm going to add them to the utilization list because they are only credit cards to help cushion your credit report. And these are um, easier credit cards to get approved for. So a few to, few of those credit cards you may want to write this down because I know I'm not going to be able to edit this um, website before I post this video, but I still want you all to know about it. So a few of those credit cards is going to be this Lexus credit card. Um, that's the one that that person got that three thousand dollars with. That's the easier one to get. That Toyota um, credit card you want to pre qualify for that one. It's going to be an Equifax hard pool for um, that Toyota and the Lexus, but. I've been seeing a lot of people getting approved for that credit card, even if they have bad credit. And those credit cards can help cushion your credit reports. Um, the Tempur-Pedic credit card, the Yamaha credit card, the, I keep saying I'm going to edit this, but I didn't edit. Oh my gosh. The Bob's Furniture, the Sealy Finance. And like, you can use all of these as cushions because you probably don't want to go to Tempur-Pedic. You probably don't want to go to Bob's Furniture, but they can still give you a $5,000, $10,000 credit card, and it can help you when you're using too much of your other credit cards. But again, to answer that question um, that the person sent to me, um, do they think that they should close it even, or should, um, should they keep it even though they don't have a Lexus? I will still keep it because it can cushion your credit reports. If you have a lot of other credit cards, like $10,000, $20,000 credit cards that's on your credit reports right now and it's cushioning it the way I'm trying to teach you all, then I would possibly close it. But just make sure it don't get added to your credit reports. If it get added to your credit reports and then you close it, it's going to look bad. So, um, yeah, I would take that into consideration if you have a lot of credit cards and this is kind of like one of your higher credit cards i will leave it there you finally got a higher credit card because when you apply for more credit cards they're going to try to match that three thousand or go higher so keep that on there but hopefully this video was helpful to you all don't forget if you having a hard time getting approved for credit cards then make sure you all join my exclusive credit membership. So I have my dollar trial right there. You all can definitely join my exclusive credit membership. And if you guys have like negative accounts in your credit reports, maybe you don't want to join an exclusive credit membership. Maybe you want to work it on work on it on your own. Go ahead and get my dispute letter package. Round one letters, go ahead and remove some inquiries, work on your bankruptcy, stop collection call. It's so many different letters I have available on here that you all can go ahead and um try and a lot of saving challenges so you guys can start saving money like the way i do and also budgeting systems but go ahead and check out my dispute letters and my budgeting sy um, systems but they're all on my website all things rakita hopefully this was helpful to you all let me know what other lists you want me to make so i know a few lists i need to make is the equifax only list because i have a um a transunion only transunion inquiry only i have to do an equifax and Experian for this um I don't think anybody wanted me to do like a college student list, but if there's any other special list you want me to make, let me know. I can definitely make that list for you all, but I'll see you guys in the next video.